true nature and I want to give my energy to that <coughs> then if I do that you know okay so then I find myself I come to the Hare Krishna temple and I listen to the philosophy and I chant and I think yes this is really nice and then all of a sudden I find myself in the kitchen cutting vegetables and washing pots or out on the street uh, distributing books and then being asked how many books did you distribute, how much money did you collect uh, and so on and so I might you know forget my original purpose but Krishna doesn't Krishna doesn't and even if uh, in the course of time Arjun asks Krishna in the Gita he says what happens you know, if you become distracted you lose your determination Krishna says there is no loss and the implication is that Krishna will never in fact he says that, he will never forget his devotee uh, actually in this world uh, nobody really has love for, um, you know, pure love is a very, very rare thing uh, so if we can get even a little love for Krishna that's already more powerful than anything else that we might feel we have any attachments they fall away very quickly and I always remember here when I was a new devotee I heard just one line of a lecture um, Prabhupada said in the beginning you may just offer a little to Krishna you know Krishna says offer me a fruit or, fruit or flower or water so in the beginning you may just offer a little uh, but then you will come back and you will give more and more Oh, and this is how the process unfolds. So it is easy. You said, "What's the easiest way?" The easiest way is, is just to somehow or another do some service, and don't worry too much about the future. Very <laughs> right, Krishna, Thank you very much.